Hello, I'm going to be reacting to Style Rick announcers. And I mean all of them. So Style Rick announcers basically like announce the rank you get and it's usually pretty common in Demon Hunter and I believe Far also has Style Rick announcers if I'm not mistaken. And if you're wondering how you get the Style Rick announcer, let me just show you right here. So this is the one you need. It's defeat Dante the Double Hunter with under 20 casualties, aka deaths. Part time, a team is six or more players, an overall team rank or a mega. So that's how you get the Style Rick announcer. That one there. I've actually tried like three of them so far. I haven't like listened to all of them in full depth. Disclaimer out there that um I won't be like featuring everything up to Demon Hunter because of my current skill sets. So you're gonna only going to hear like snippets, maybe up to like a certain rank. But yeah, I'm really excited and we're gonna get started. Here we are, Star Wars announcer. Tell us the preference of which who gets to announce the ranks while using Demon Hunter. Yeah, I think it's mostly Demon Hunter. I might be wrong. Changes made upon this preference will be applied upon respawn. So there's these guys right here. And fun fact, these are voiced by DTS community members. And then there's these guys right here. Um, I actually had this one on because I was like having a little fun with it. Um, Balrog is the default style rank announcer and it's voiced by Radish, also known as Toxic Zombie 10674. I'm actually gonna start with Balrog just to like get a little like like what you're expecting from it. It's basically like very obviously default that what you get. I'm gonna play like because you hear it a lot, I'm gonna play like only a little snippet of it. So yeah, he just says destructive, chaotic, ruler, etc. I think you get the idea. They're just announcing like everything said on this right here. Obviously, like this is the default everyone gets. So there's that. I don't think I need to showcase everything because it's kind of obvious of what it does. So let's just like go to the first one. And for this case, I want to go for these guys. So first, we could do Croissant Connoisseur, which is have the French Revolution judge your gameplay in a manner of which mistakes made. We'll send you the Panera bread. Okay. Um. Oh, I did. Okay. Laughing move French. I have actually tried this like yesterday. Oh. Okay, well. Ah, not shift lock. Okay. I'll take it, he says. He says mm, not bad. Very nice. I just realized the chaotic part. Wait, let me do that. Again. Actually, let me wait for the rig to go down. I hear perfect. It says I'll take it because it says I'll take it. Let me show you what I mean. Wait, so this if I can. Like I'm hearing. It's yeah. See, it says I'll take it, but I hear perfect. Maybe I'm just. Maybe I'm just have really bad hearing or something. So let's see if I can get this Anaki. Because I haven't heard anything beyond Anaki. Yes. <laughs> he literally just says yes, like if you hit if you hit like Supreme, he says yes! And then oh ew, that sounds cringe actually. What the heck? And then he goes in like yes! If you hit that. Oh god, that is so hilarious. But yeah. Uh, that's French Connoisseur. I think I like it. French Connoisseur. It's Croissant Connoisseur. Oh, uh, I, I actually don't know what to call it. So I'm gonna try this soundboard, which reads Replicates the true experience of having an arms race between NATO, the same cream port, and weaponized soundboards. That sounds. Actually, I have like zero expectation of what to expect. Do a first impression. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Okay, no. Yeah, I'm gonna say the soundboard is uh interesting. I'm gonna say it's like really funny. It's just can't. It's just like. 
turn your volume down a bit because at uh, the first when you hear destructive, it's really loud. <laughs> oh god. I don't know if I'll be able to recover from that honestly. The next one is sugarcoat and it just reads... I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Let's see what it offers. Wow! That's the sound effect I hear a lot. Okay. <laughs> okay, wow. Is that the same thing over and over again? Is the same just damn over and over again? <laughs> oh my god, is it like is it that is it like going off every time I kill? It is! It's literally just Say damn, it goes off every time you kill a noob. Yeah, like. Okay, uh, yeah, I think it's straightforward. It just says damn, and... <laughs> wow, it gets louder every time! The final one from this category is Kirby Voice Acting. I know where this is going. Let's just... Let's do this. Oh! Interesting! Oh god, okay. I'm gonna die at this stage. Cause I can only go up to wave 15 whenever I'm doing Demon Hunters alone. I just take this, take that, okay, interesting. Yeah. I didn't expect Kirby voice acting to be like that. Okay. Um, that's the category I called was like miscellaneous. I am not ready to rumble. Okay. Okay. Oh wait, does it repeat? Like, if I drop a rank, does it repeat again? That is so interesting. Oh yeah, it does repeat again uh, if I drop a rank. Okay, that is something I've never heard before. Because a lot of times when you drop a rank, um, like, it doesn't repeat the same thing again. So, like, if you, like, drop all the way, like, past destructive, then, then, um, it, like, repeats everything again. I did, I thought, I was, like, preparing for, like, the funny, honestly, but I didn't expect this, all of, like, not sure where the source is actually from because I am uneducated as heck. We got these out of the way. <laughs> now we do these ones here. And um, first, I'm going to unlock the doxes because I've already done this already, like off camera. Which is for the, when you have a bad day, don't worry, someone can remedy on that. Voice by add this guy's kid. So if I'm like pronouncing some of these names wrong. So this is the foot. So I've heard this before. I think I'm afraid the statue. <laughs> And the hand washing, like, goes on for god knows how long. Oh my god, this is so funny. At some point, I'm not sure which rank it is, Addy, like, Joker laughs. I don't know if I'm able to achieve that. Okay, so let's see. Oh, what's not this one? I swear, I think that was like a, I thought that was like a choker laugh. Well, maybe that's the one. That's sadistic. That that's like I hear like a choker laugh sort of thing. I I don't know much about choker, so I say that one is pretty uh chill and like laid back for those who don't want to be like too overwhelmed. So my guys, I get pretty overwhelmed that easily. Very casual. Well, actually, there's a casual announcement, which I'll get to that later. Yeah, let's move on to the one that I already like, heard before. Which is Japan culture. Complete the true experience of a Japan. 
Japanese dub Demon Hunter, the anime of all time, voiced by Kento, also as Kenny won a lot of nines. So this is the one I've already heard. I've already gotten like heard most of it. This is all in Japanese, so I have to maybe if, if I have the chance. In Premiere, I have to like put subtitles in it because I mean, this provides subtitles, so like this. <laughs> they actually put subtitles, it's basically speaking Japanese. Yeah, then those are clappy noises. I mean, uh, I guess it goes really fast. I think I put like up to Demon Hunter. I'm not sure what he says like after Demon Hunter. But like, I was like filming it off, not filming it, but like I was uh, using it off camera. All right, we done these two. I think I'm gonna try a random one. Let's see. I'm gonna pick a random one. Boomer shooter. Okay, what's a boomer shooter? Announces that we an old-fashioned battle, like games such as Quake. Doom and the legendary Window 90 emulator, voiced by Dash, also known as the One New Blade. I never heard this one before, so I'm kind of very intrigued. Actually, I'm kind of intrigued for all of them. Okay, let's get a first impression. Jesus Christ, it's already chaotic. Whoa, okay, that is so intense. Oh, I killed Space of Lost before anything else. Okay, disappointment. This is so like demonic and intense. But I like it. Yeah, I hear this a lot in like a lot of like what's it called? Hack and slash games or like like rapid shooter games. They say like these guys if you like do if you get like multi-kills or like triple kills or whatsoever. See? Like it's sick, that sounds so familiar! Like it's so like, I hear this so much. Oh, I lost my demon hunter break. Wow, that... Hold the gun as I expected. Because most of the time I will heal like Demon Hunter rank, but only like. I'm gonna fail at this one. I only hold like Demon Hunter for like. like only a few seconds, but that was actually longer than I expected. Holy heck. But yeah, overall conclusion. Um, I feel like the like, Boomer Shooter would be like. It's very simple, straight to the point, with like a very intense voice. Um. And this takes me back to the time when I would play like first person shooter games and like these like like first kill, or second kill, or triple kill, or stuff like that. Yeah. I don't care about the statue that much. I just want to react to the voices. I really get nostalgia from that. Okay, that is Boomer Shooter. Let's move on to the next one. Let's do Cash. Elitist. Okay, let's do Elitist. Ooh, Elitist. I should read that quickly. Um, tackles upon announcing every style ring from a certified third time world champion Elitist from Devil May Cry series. Warning! You will receive 90 wrong wrong doings from cinem cinemasis. Voice right advisory captain. Also known as Epic Matt 629. Fun fact, this guy was actually in like my default video. I'm gonna have a first impression as usual. So I need to repeat that again. Oh. Okay. I feel like this announcer really does have very high expectations. Especially if it says like Double May Cry, which I've never played Double May Cry. I actually don't know what the gameplay for Double May Cry looks like because I've never like seen one Double May Cry. Gameplay before. Um. Okay. Well, if you want. Oh, too bad. I just dropped the ring. Back. 
Let's do... Who is she with? Untitled Bird Creature. Announces a style rings from a certified animal planet, National Geographic, and a History's Channel host. Make sure it's not 3 a.m. in the morning. Well, right now for me, it's 11.10 in the morning. It's voiced by Zeno, also known as Zacro. I'm expecting David Adam to be on as well. I can't assume things too quickly. Let's see. Oh, I'm getting a paid hour. No, no. I'm not. <laughs> cool. Uh, I guess. Me. Mood. This is not enough. Oh, let's see if I can. Wow, I, I now I know why it's like Jassel Geographic sort of situation. Yeah, it's actually pretty laid back. Oh wait, does it like? Hang on, hang on, Zach. I need to read the dialogue of this. Like it capitalizes like the ranking. So like it's, when he says like you're getting paid a dollar for this, it capitalizes D. You need like you got destructive. See? Right there. You should be glad! Haha! <laughs> I bet that was a pun intended. <laughs> this is not a nest! I will not tolerate this! I'm gonna die, help! I'm gonna die, help! Oh god! In conclusion, I actually find this pretty chill. I was expecting like something else, but yeah, I really like it. Oh, I'm gonna say this for like every announcer I do. At the end of the day, whatever I hear, I really like the announcers. And I think every announcer who participated did a really great job. The next one is casual. Casually announces ranks tailored to your needs of becoming a true master of flooding people housing your sweat, tears, and broken keyboards. Voiced by Angra Saruna. I hope I pronounced that name right, sorry. Also known as uh, S123. Oh god, I need water. Yeah, it's very usual. First impression of casual. Okay, start. I like that. It's super optimistic. You're starting somewhere. I feel very motivated. See if I can get past destructive. Because I remember starting out Demon Hunters for the first time and having no pick up a clue. And then I get like people saying, you should be a shift block or something. Bring the pain! And versus. Yo, it's happening! Well, let's see if I can do that, man. God, I like how enthusiastic this guy is. Kyle is very enthusiastic. I really like that energy that I'm getting from it. Now for a grand finale. Competitive voice by our boy Nerox, also known as Xcanus. Aggressively announced style ranks along with judging your gameplay aspects for being a subdominal demon hunting elitist. We are not responsible for any emotional distress caused by this. Oh. Well, after I got to casual and I felt really pumped up. I don't think it's gonna be that bad, but I think I'm going into this too optimistically. So let's see the best for last. <laughs> what the? What the? Oh god! <laughs> oh god! I didn't. <laughs> this is like a first time I've done so. I like how it says competitive toxicity levels rising. Do it again! Approaching danger levels of toxicity. Unless... Again! Oh! Do it again! Do it again! I like the, the effect of like, approaching toxicity levels, but... After I went to casual, and then I switched to competitive and this happens... Man!
Uh, probably. Don't do it again. And again. Crap, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, Sash, you're gonna die. Oh, give me one second. Okay, that was competitive. Am I emotionally distressed? I think? But I found it like so funny though. Like, he's like, How are you this bad? That was uh, the announcers for Demon Hunters. Honestly, for those who like participated in being announced for Demon Hunter, I don't know if you can hear my clap. Y'all the greats out there. Give yourself a pat on the back. And my hand hurts right now.